When it comes to emergency preparedness, having a well-thought-out plan and the right supplies can make all the difference. Here are the essential steps every prepper needs to take. First, assess the risk specific to your area. This could include natural disasters like hurricanes, earthquakes, or floods, as well as man-made threats such as power outages or civil unrest. Understanding these risks will help you prioritize your preparations. Next, ensure you have a sufficient stockpile of basic supplies. Aim for at least 10 days worth of food and water. Non-perishable items like canned goods, dried fruits, and bottled water are ideal. Don't forget a manual can opener. Equally important is a comprehensive first aid kit. This should include bandages, antiseptics, pain relievers, and any prescription medications you or your family might need. Having the knowledge to use these items effectively is crucial, so consider taking a first aid course. Now, let's talk about bugging in versus bugging out. Bugging in means staying put and fortifying your home. This requires a secure, defensible space with all necessary supplies readily available. Bugging out, on the other hand, involves evacuating to a safer location. For this, you'll need a well-equipped bug-out bag. This should include essentials like food, water, clothing, and tools, all packed and ready to go at a moment's notice. Speaking of tools, there are several items every prepper should have on hand. A multi-tool is invaluable for a wide range of tasks. A reliable flashlight, preferably with extra batteries or a solar charger, is essential. For navigation, a compass and detailed maps of your area are a must. Communication devices, such as a hand crank radio and walkie-talkies, can keep you informed and in touch during an emergency. In addition to physical supplies, skill development is a key aspect of preparedness. Learn basic survival skills like fire starting, water purification, and shelter building. These skills can be life-saving when supplies run low or if you find yourself in the wilderness. Water is perhaps the most critical resource in any survival situation. Store plenty of bottled water and consider having a portable water filter or purification tablets as a backup. Remember, you can only survive a few days without water, so having multiple sources and methods of purification is crucial. Food storage requires careful planning. Store a variety of non-perishable foods and rotate them regularly to ensure freshness. Consider learning to can and preserve your own food to increase your self-sufficiency. Security is another vital consideration. Ensure your home is secure with strong locks and perhaps even a security system. For personal protection, be familiar with and trained in the use of any self-defense tools you have. Lastly, maintain a positive mindset. Mental resilience can help you stay calm and make rational decisions during stressful situations. Practice mindfulness or meditation techniques to enhance your mental fortitude.